So we have Megan Chaffins here. Um, so why did you decide to do a master's in coaching? I decided to do a master's in coaching because my ultimate goal is to be a division one track and field coach. Um, I remember when I was a sophomore, Professor Hallbrook, I had a class with her. She was like talking about how there might be this master's in coaching and sport leadership program. And this was a couple years ago, so as soon as she mentioned it in my class, I was like, if we're actually having this program at Randolph, I have to do it because I know that it will help me in the long run. So my mind was made up from the beginning, but um, I'm just really excited to be in this program right now because I know it's going to be really beneficial for me in the long run. So what made you decide to stay at Randolph? I'm not ready to leave yet, honestly. I love the environment here. I love my coaches. I love my teammates. I love my classmates. I'm just not ready to leave yet, um, especially since this program is at Randolph. It was no question about it. I knew I was going to apply. If I got in, I knew that was the decision that I was going to make was to continue in the program. And I know you're coming back for another year for track and field. So what are your goals um, about coming back for another year? I have a lot of goals. Um, my overall team goal is just to, as a captain, lead my team to success. So we want to move up in the ODAC. Um, we want to move up higher placement. So I'm going to try my best to lead my team to that goal. Um, individually, I have a lot of goals as well. Um, for long jump, I want to be in the 18 feet area. For triple jump, I want to be in the 36 feet area. For high jump, I want to be consistently clearing five feet at every meet. Those are just some goals that I have for myself for next season that I'm going to work my butt off to achieve. Yeah. And how do you think the program will be beneficial to you in the long run? Well, being that my overall goal is to be a Division I track and field coach, I know that this program is going to prepare me for that. Um, honestly, I really don't have a lot of coaching experience besides when I was younger in high school. I used to do like little private lessons with younger kids on the track and field team when their mom would ask me to help them out. So that's really the only um, track and field coaching experience that I have. And I know that this program is not only going to prepare me to be a coach, but I'm going to get that hands-on learning experience, and that's what I'm really looking for. Um, we do have required practicum sites that we have to do like every seven weeks, and I know that those hands-on learning practicums are really what's going to help me become a better coach and get that hands-on learning experience. And last question, what is your plan after completing the program and your ultimate goal? So after the program, I'm going to apply for, my plan is to apply for some assistant coaching jobs um, just to get some more experience because I know that head coach of a D1 track and field program, that's not going to come right away. I'm aware that I have to take certain steps to get there. So I'm going to apply for some assistant coaching positions and just see where that leads me, get some more experience, and then when the time is right, I'll begin applying for head coaching positions. Alrighty, thank you so much, Megan. You're welcome.